Man, I just don't like the socks. There isn't a button that I want to click on. Let's look up colorless cards real quick. Peace, Peacecraft. The streamers are working on a mod balancing mostly with nerfs to overpower stuff. Yeah, lots of people do that. Never a rare, right? Mm -hmm. One of the weird things about this, it looks like it could give you a rare, but actually it's a colorless card reward and your rare chance is zero. It's only uncommons. I am uninspired by them. Let's take under gold. Some it's club things for the 35 months. Man. Not a great start to the run, to be honest. This is my night. It's going okay. I don't think this takes more than 12 on average. It might, um... Might be higher variance though. Nine plus twelve plus twelve next turn. X one. Looks like I got bailed out a little bit. The Moscow thinks the eight months. I think the common pitfall of attempting balancing mods is that you are inside your own head about what is and isn't strong in a game, and it doesn't necessarily match what other people think is strong in the game. I'm gonna take Indignation, because I just need something that my deck does. I guess that's kind of a thing that my deck does. Okay. A great first turn for it. I don't think I'm taking Deceive Reality. Grenache thinks the 38 months, appreciate it. I'm Tris thinks the 10 months. Lark this Lark thinks it's 37 months. Okay, do I want to potentially die to Gremlin Mob? Not really. Like a Bowling Bash and rest. Bowling Bash gets me through sentries. Which is currently like a very large achievement. I think I have to take a rest. Alright. Graminism. I mean... 
Max HP centuries. I'm glad I took a bowling bash. <laughs> glad I took a bowling bash. I guess I'm playing Eruption and killing this. And we hope for no Mega Whammies next turn. Took some stuff at a campfire and then forget how to backflip. Yeah, it's rough. At the moment, it's a zero damage fight. Okay, I have now taken two damage. Probably take some damage this turn too, but that was, uh, I would say, pretty good. I didn't take any damage this turn. Did I just take two against Super Elite Sentries with this deck? <laughs> we take those! Alright. Okay. Um. Hey, Jungle Steve, how are you? Hey, Chaos. Well, the skeptic hollow. Uh, -oh. An upgraded apotheosis. Usually, you click on this one when you play Slay the Spire. Don't think I need apotheosis in this run. There isn't really anything else to do in the shop either. Like, I could leave with all of my gold, but... The most fire feels like Ari and card remove is what we do. You have a cosplay idea for me. I didn't see that. Alright. Well, those are pretty bad. I'm probably meant to do something weird here. Like, I can go worship prostrate, prostrate, for example. Or maybe two prostrates, a worship, and a wheel kick. That might be better. There's also an establishment, but I don't think it does much. Man, do I have to think this run? It looks like I do. I could also take Deceive Reality. Or I could take Battle Him. I would rather not. I would certainly prefer not to. Some sort of janky divinity deck. How do I block? Wallop? Relics? Lots of card draw. I don't know. This is a very hard choice. Because I think it's the 20 months. Small money.
Okay, let's give this a go. I have a decent potion for it, actually. No? I don't think so? Fuck. <laughs> away from the shop without any cards probably wins a lot of the time. Very true. Very true. Next turn I have like 36. I don't know if taking cards wins more or less there. Art of War. Oh my god, what a fucking weird run. There's a Tantrum. There's a Perseverance Plus with Art of War. <laughs> Should we just do something fucking weird? Did I lose already? I don't know. Don't know. Fuck it, it's Friday night! Plus 27? Oh, I guess that just kills it? Okay. I guess that just kills it. Looking forward to the pandas? Me too. I would like to get rid of the cards that are in my deck and replace them with other cards. <laughs> I would. I would really appreciate that. Third eye plus. There have been worse moments for a third eye plus. Let's see if this beats Hexaghost. I don't know, I never found a like reliable attack really. Indignation feels a little bit likely to die next time. Blasty blue. Okay. 
get indignation. It's a decent reshuffle. Okay, that's my entire deck basically. Uh, can I do this without dying? I guess I have Perseverance and it blocks for a trillion, so yes. Man. What a disaster. But I won! I like Volt here. Volt seems quite good here. Mostly because it's Vault. I don't know. Blackstar? Blackstar seems in keeping with the uh, just completely random cards uh, approach to playing this room. I think I need my gold for card removes. So I can't take Ectoplasm. I think I need cards offered, so I can't take Busted Crown. Watcher so broken. Jank deck. Met draw is still easy one. I mean, it's not that jank. I got a Toxic Egg and then I took in four cards off an Aurary. It should be beating Act 1. It would be weird if that didn't beat Act 1. I mean, I would love to go through here. Am I going to? We can try. I am not sure that I like fighting against Chosen here. Installed the Beneath Eraser Slay the Spire mod, it removes the skip button. Skip button was too easy. Perseverance plus Vault is like kind of Loki is strong. Now they just die. Wait, it didn't die. Windmill Strike. It's not as bad as it seems. It does seem pretty bad, though. It does seem pretty bad. Bolt the burp. Really trusting Bowling Bash to kill Slavers for me by itself here. But also, I guess Gremlin Leader. It's a lot of faith placed in Bowling Bash. You're welcome, small money SB. Am I going to say it's Jorban time at the book reading? If someone asks politely. I think I kind of need a Windmall Strike. It's just one more bad card. How bad can one more bad card be?
Maybe a Mayashi, we'll see. Okay, okay. Red Mask, low-key kind of good here. Cut Through Fate kind of okay too. I don't think I'm taking an unupgraded Cut Through Fate though. Man, I kind of would like to. Volt, good card, question mark. It's a thought. Wanted you to watch me dissolve. Give me this potion. See what the elites have for me. Okay, speed potion turn, I guess. Oh, I'd only save two health. Never mind. I take a buck. I just wanted you to watch me to Okay. Is it vigilance first? What if it's vigilance first? I don't have an energy potion. Maybe vigilance first. Man, it's really unfortunate that none of them have 50 health. I think it is. Alright, hopefully I'm not taking much damage here. Oh, am I tonight? I'm doing well. No complaints. Good fight. Relics? Is it over yet? It's basically over though. I don't think it's possible for me to take damage though. It's very hard. Nunchaku a bottled tornado. Well, battling mental fortress is okay. Good bottle study. Take a foreign influence.
It's so much more exciting than a normal watcher run is. Like anything could happen right now. It's wild. You think you're too horny to be able to fight Donu Deka? That's rough. At least you know your limitations. I should have used this for two health, maybe. I feel okay with what I did. It's wild. It is wild. The cat keeps trying to type in every cat chat that you join. Yeah, you should uh tell it not to do that. Wonder how one stops a cat from typing though. Sounds kind of like suppression of speech. Maybe that would be inappropriate actually. 60 plus, no, 90 plus. I meant to hit this. Relatively confident. Call it a hunch. Doesn't feel like it mattered. <laughs> Last one thinks of the 76 months. How are you? Strawberry old coin. All right. I want a spirit shield. Kinda. Upgraded. Blocks for like a lot. Also take a fear no evil. Fuck it. They're not the best watcher cards. I have heard of them. I think this will block more later. This is kind of awkward.
Not sure this does end up getting a chance to block. Chances that I die if I play Eruption here, non-zero. Definitely non-zero. I don't think I need to do that. I need to do that. Was I dead with this hand? Maybe. I think not quite nearly though. Mango seems relevant to my current interests. I have 500 gold. Do I still take question marks? I think I still take question marks. I just got a question mark store. for this elite fight. I came to this elite fight deliberately, believe it or not. Kind of regretting my choice. Hey, it's my good cards. Use Miracle for six health. Don't think so. the slavers. Sundial. Man, wish plus. Is this a wish plus kind of situation? It could be. I only have 800 gold, so I could use some more gold. I think I'm mostly using it for plated armor, and honestly, that doesn't seem that bad. I get vulnerable into 31 tier, maybe I just die. Doesn't happen yet. I keep on thinking that these songs are Bo Burnham songs. Wonder what Mike Snow has to say for himself. Why is your music so similar to Bo Burnham's music? The prostates? Prostrates, rather? <clears throat> I don't know. 
I guess it's powerful to be able to uh, worship into divinity whenever I want. Eh. I don't think Champ can beat me. I would be kind of upset if Champ beat the stuck. Ashland! Thoughts on relics at scale with gold. I think they're generally silly. I didn't die. In fact, they don't even seem to be taking any damage. Another egg? It'd be kind of nice to upgrade Mental Fortress. Are the Chosens the candidates to be turned into a weakened one in Act 3? I think that is a strong hypothesis. Take a safety rest versus champ. Dead. This deck can absolutely misfire and just die. I don't think it did. I think the way that it happened was on like turn one and two. Also though, um, I think this deck's actually pretty strong if I make it back four, so I don't know. I could have upgraded Mental Fortress, I thought about it. That's some damage. Windmill Strike has Dark Orb, yeah. This split unironically. I guess we do eat the fruit relics when we pick them up.
How does Windmill Strike get stronger canonically? I think you're just winding up, like a Dragon Ball Z sort of situation. I've been winding up for about two episodes right now. We are now fully wound. Devotion? Devotion angle? Get a Molten Egg and a Toxic Egg and then start taking powers. Standard gameplay. Millionaires angry about property values? Oh, okay. I'm just wondering if I take Spirit Shield. Because that one also seems pretty reasonable. Wish I had like a Runic Pyramid. That'd be good. I also skip. The ocean's not that strong. Reptomancer is kind of terrible. Ter terrible, terrifying, and kind of spooky. I to get another spirit shield. I cannot believe. Absolutely cannot believe that I didn't get Runic Pyramid. MF Gusto! How am I retaining my hand every turn? My cards have retain written on them. I give up an elite to go to another shop. Especially since Reptomancer kills me sometimes. Feels bad to give up an elite though. What do shops even do? Card removes. Don't kill me. Go to more question marks. The orb walkers kill me sometimes. Not that often though. Watcher's card draw is kind of bad, isn't it? I have four energy against elites though. Not interested in shops in the 100 gold? I mean, I'm definitely going to two shops in this run. It's just, do I want to give up an elite to go to three? Let's go to here. And I can choose left or right. I guess my card draws actually retain, mostly. Yeah.
It'd be cool if you bring your shovel to Ados. Would you like me to sign a shovel for you? I'll sign a shovel for you if you bring it to Ados. It's incredible how bad my relics are. I have so many, and they're so bad. I can't take Flurry because it doesn't interact with anything. Wow. Uh, this hauling actually breaks my deck. That's unreal. <laughs> That's unreal. I guess Centennial Puzzle I like. I'm gonna go right. I want to skip the wheel spinning animation. The wheel spinning animation is okay. Did you see that that one lady died? How wild is that? Not sure why she was working in our government at the age of 19. Well, like, she should have been an end of life care. I got another one. I guess I take it. Is this good? It's not that good. How do you hit me that hard? Can we talk about this? This deck seems pretty bad against Transient, actually. I don't know about this fight. Percent Congress has been preserved. Alzheimer's medicine. Yo, they can see doctors. I should become a politician. Rank or plated armor. Actually, no. Have uh, worship still? No.
Okay, I didn't die that turn. Next turn looks pretty bad, though. <laughs> I won't die from 65. Just like, do I enter calm? Which case I take. Like 50 maybe. Versus if I stay in wrath. take more than that. Alright. How did I do that math so badly? I did that math really badly. Die. Actually, battle him. I think it's actually battle him. Never a good sign when it's battle hum. Agree. Agree. It's an okay battle hum here though. Master Reality were here. Where was Master Reality when the 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 writers of Rohan? I, I don't remember. Where was Gondor when uh something? When the Westfold fell? Fuck. The Westfold fell? I don't even know. What are y'all gonna tell me about that? to do math. Uh, I don't think I do have to do math. It looks like it's just obviously lethal. I actually have another energy. I was somehow missing I had. Wing boots? I mean, now we can really die to elites. There isn't anything to do with these. I guess I can get a rest off that campfire. Go one, two, three, but I lose my shot. 
One, two. I guess I just use it for a rest. It's either a rest or another elite. <sighs> Key to watch is playing Volt a lot. I see. I think the key to watcher might be resting at the campfire. These are such bad wing boots. Blows my mind. Some boat relics would be nice. They would. Mangoes like a boat relic if you don't think about it too hard. This is a good moment for battle him. Kind of. Mayhem ever killing me? Maybe. Sometimes. Mango is important on boats. Probably true. Yells here. Is every turn so scary? The human condition. Mostly just that my deck is bad. <laughs> it's a pretty bad deck. You don't really want uh, at all trance to be the best damage in your deck. It's not really what you're looking for in any run, let alone a watcher run. Oh, all right, nice. Finally getting the good stuff. Do I even need a salvage run? What does it do? I just take another Perseverance. I don't have any card draw, so it doesn't, like, do anything. I guess Battle Him is like card draw. If it doesn't do anything, I'm just going to take another per blah, 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 blah. Perseverance. Blah 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 blah. Run skills. Do I want to rest? I think so. Pretty sure I want to rest. Maybe recall. Maybe if I find some good sustain, I can upgrade Mental Fortress. That would be a good upgrade. Actually, that would be pretty good. Played the fund, I guess. Ah, it
Game Tactic Gallery links in 38 months. You're welcome. This is strength. I probably could go gold there. I suspect gold would be okay. I can't play Eruption now. Whoops. It's gotta be close to being lethal. Bottled lightning. What's that do? Will that do something? Bottle of wish, bottle of vault. Perseverance? And I never found a meditate. That is kind of rough. Not all mini jorbs. Interesting idea. Huh. Should we go to this hallway fight? Do you think it's better? Maybe there's a way for the hallway fight to change my mind to make me go to an elite instead of the shop. I can't imagine what it is, but I mean, there's no downside here. Do not bottle a cat. No one bottles the cat. You might be wondering what that means. I have no idea. Um, I got a recall pillow. That makes a decision to uh, delay my rest better. Bottle a cat. I don't think a cat would like that. Oh my god, this is the first time I've ever listened to the lyrics of this song. The lyrics of this song are You're just my type, you've got a pulse and you're breathing. I didn't know. <laughs> very funny. It's very funny. Creeps you out. It's a bit creepy. A bit creepy. Is the plan to mathematically leave membership card and career as some of the only remaining relics? <laughs> yeah, working on it, right? We're getting there.
Got our Ragnarok. I guess I'm buying everything. Why would I not buy everything at this point? Do I want to Ragnarok? With Talkland Plus? I guess I do, actually. I run out of energy with um, Battle Him and Ragnarok. Too bad. I'll have to do something about that somehow. You know what? I need more gold. You went to black. There was this one time when I was a kid. When a kid whose name was Ellie had the teacher of the class tell him that he pronounced his name wrong. Vanta Black made me think of this for some reason. I'm not even really sure why. Anyway. It is surreal. I do have Deep Breath and Sundial, it's true. I wish it was stronger than it is, but it's not nothing. People tell you that, that you pronounce your own name wrong. <laughs> you okay? Sure I do. This or this? They both seem kind of okay. Angry or Colma? Colma, I think. I just upgrade Mental Fortress next deck, I guess. I could use the health, maybe. I see Time Eater being a little bit iffy. I do have double uh, thingamajig, though, so it should be okay. You know what I mean. I forgive you if you don't know what I mean. But I will not be explaining further. Perseverance, that's what it's called. You know what? That was a pretty fucking good showing for Ragnarok first time it was drawn. That was not bad at all. Weird that it didn't kill everything? It looked like it killed everything to me. I don't know what you're expecting from it. The flame incoming. Gosh, would that I were so lucky. Mm-hmm. 
Sunami doesn't do very much if you don't, um, play powers, huh? I wonder if anyone's tried doing that. Just not playing powers against Awakened One. Something to consider. Make a note of that for later. What if I wait until Windmill Strength one shot second phase? Uh, I might. I think some of my block is reliant on dealing damage, though. I'm not sure I'll be able to. But I mean, Awakened One isn't scaling, and I very literally am. Quality of life and monsters slay the spire. Yep, stuff like color coded minimap, for example, is popular. Did I ever figure out the scale puzzle I talked about? Oh, I did, yeah. The solution was quite satisfying, too. I recommend giving it a go if you haven't. For those of you who don't know the puzzle, actually the reason I have poker chips on my desk is that I was using them to solve the puzzle. Suppose you have one, two, oops, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve weights with identical appearance, but one of them is a different weight from all the others. And you have a set of scales, so you could weigh one weight on one side and one weight on the other, and the set of scales would tell you which one was heavier or if they were the same weight. The white poker chip represents the one that's different weight, so in this case it would be either heavier or lighter, but you don't actually know which one, given the statement of the puzzle. Whereas if you had two of the same weights, they would weigh the same. The puzzle is, how can you work out which weight is the one that weighs a different amount from the other 11 in three weighings? It's a good puzzle. It's a real thinker. You know? Me too. You're just like me, for real, for real. You have to solve that puzzle for a campaign, like a D&D &D campaign? It's pretty cool. Answer upset you? I found the answer so satisfying. Mm. 
We were worried about card draw, question mark. Well, we're fighting an enemy that doesn't scale, so it looks like our deck does really well, but that's because it's like turn 52 or something. <laughs> Isn't it just six on a side, then three on a side, then one on a side? Which three on a side? Is 12 weights total. You do six on each side, then which which three do you put on each side afterwards? You were annoyed with yourself for struggling with it so much? Oh no. It's a hard puzzle. Struggling with it is very understandable. Mm, okay, I'm taking that much damage. Let's take one instead. Best part about being a computer science student is how much of your course material is related to puzzles like this. This one came up in a search algorithms AI class a week ago. Nice. Doesn't matter because if they weigh the same, it's the other six set, and you know if the odd weight is lighter or heavier. And you know by now if the odd weight is lighter or heavier. Okay, so you have used two weighings, and now you know that the odd weight is one of six weights. How are you going to use your last weighing to determine which of the six weights the odd weight is? Ow. Twelve weights and three wings. Play way three individual weights, you've got a twenty five percent chance of getting it right. <laughs> No, you don't. <laughs> you just like put them on the scales? And the scales tell you that they have weight? Oh. Um. <laughs> Sorry. It's a good idea. It's a good idea. You simply tell by picking them up. Good strategy. Kind of embarrassing that I didn't think of that. Ragnarok is big block. Forty eight, forty eight, forty eight, sixty. This looks like we Depending on how much 18 is. 
Okay, it's actually really close. 144, 204. Let's play 4. It's actually really close. Six and six, then take light stack of three and three, light stack any two. You don't know that the light stack is the oddly weighted weight in it. Because the oddly weighted weight might be heavier. Is there some silly way to tell without any branching? I don't think so. Seems unlikely. I'm gonna take study, I guess. And stone calendar. How good is magnetism here? What if it's good? Wait, this actually works sometimes? Oh yeah, I definitely need study. I don't know about the other shit. Wondering if I want the dex potion? Wondering if I want the fairy in a bottle? I wonder if I've ever lost a watcher run with over a page of relics. Because I'm about to. <laughs> I've got bottled flame talk to the hand, but it doesn't actually work against the elites, really. Definitely okay. Is beneficial against the heart. There are a lot of bad hits on um, magnetism. I might just have enough. We'll see. Instead of typing your solution in chat, you could try doing it, and then it wouldn't work, and then you wouldn't have to type it in chat. It's an interesting exercise. Try to prove that your solution doesn't work, instead of trying to come up with a solution that does work. Actually, I do want to take damage, don't I? Shit, I can't do that anymore. I can again, but I'm not going to... for a spirit shield. I am struggling to find one. Ah. 
That was really weird. But I guess... In the end, I drew spirit shield, so it's okay. I don't, I don't actually understand what that was. Jarhead, thanks for the tier 3 sub! Hope you're doing well. Shuffle your discard pile into your draw pile, then draw two cards. Whenever you shuffle your draw pile, scry three. So... It feels like with the order that the card says it's working in, I should scry and then draw two, but I didn't. I'm not sure what to make of that. Call a judge? Thinking about it. Heavily considering it. Seven and eighty four. Not lethal. Can use indignation and weak potion. That's a lot to use. Six, twelve. 25. Fuck. Uh, Okay. How close is Stone Calendar? Actually, really close. I don't think I'm killing that, am I? Can't see what Windmill Strike is. Maybe I am killing it. I think I am killing it. I don't know. I'm not sure what this is. Okay. Is it six and six and the odd grouping you put on that scale? Which one's the odd grouping? 
you don't know. <laughs> Good shot. Good shot, I'm losing my mind. <laughs> Did I already say that already? to in. Chaku's not working. Do I leave Wrath now? There are ways. It's a good start. I guess it's also just dead, right? Stone calendar. All right. Duality, oddly smooth stone. Kind of interesting. Whatever conjure blade. It may actually be conjure blade. It it probably is actually conjure blade with talk to the hand. Did I bottle talk to the hand? I don't remember. I did. Okay. Take a conjure blade. use Miracle here because I want to... Let's do this. I want to block with Spirit Shield. Okay, with using Tranquility this turn. So I don't even need to? Maybe I should though. Nunchaku, it works really well. Okay. I think I'm going plated armor. I think I have enough random bullshit damage to win. Is that true? I don't know. I 
I'm not 100% sure. The reason why you take damage from heart when you change stance with mental fortress and indignation, the game's just coded poorly. That is the reason. this here. Not really going to do better than that. Kind of hard to play any of these cards. I guess I probably should. Uh, that turn feels like it lost me the run, kind of. Just not a good feeling. This turn looks okay, though. Did I say that to Megacrit if they were here? Yeah, 100%, and they would agree with me. They would be like, yup. <laughs> There is a next turn, unfortunately. It's kind of rude, but it's also true. been a wild watcher run. I wonder if I win. Need to find deep breath now. Oh, that was Stone Calendar. Nothing else. Um, I'm to hit kind of hard. I think I can play Battle Helm. Confident I can play Battle Helm. It's actually good. Because I get one dexterity from playing them too. Prostrates of my deck, stuff like that. Or not moving to the four years, I appreciate it! Hope you're doing well. The next turn is the terrifying turn. Okay. What will I do this turn then? Just die or like. Mm -hmm. This turn isn't real, it can't hurt me. That is a relief, because I, I thought it was going to be really bad. 
But now that you've pointed out that it isn't real, I feel much better about myself. the name of the puzzle? I don't know. Not sure. Ninety. I have a lot of insights on my hand. just get discarded, right? So what we have discovered about how that works. Okay, so I full blocked. Now I need to deal a lot of damage. I need to deal damage now, right? Okay, I'll strike here? I guess so. Yes, I do. Come down to a coin flip here. There are some small things that I should have done slightly better than I did. Get this scry next turn. I guess I have Eruption Expunger. It's a lot of damage, but I don't think it's enough damage. Double Perseverance. If it's the, um, the single attack here, I think I just win. It's not the single attack. Alright, so we have to work for it. <sighs> Maybe I don't have to work for it, actually. Maybe that is lethal. You get to enter Calm, then enter Wrath. Also, can I just block? That's probably a thing they should get asked. I 
I don't think I know what the left Perseverance blocks for. I don't think there's a way for me to know. Splendor blocks for 15. It's gotta just be going for lethal. And if I'm going for lethal, I don't know what Windwall Strike hits for. This is a disaster of a run. It is actually a disaster. This is a UI nightmare. Is that me here? Suppose I hit Ragnarok, 45 plus 12 times 6 is 72. Basically, the entire question is, like, do I have to hit a prostate, or can I win a different way more easily? If I have to hit a prostate, I should hold worship, but if I don't, maybe I shouldn't. Imagine if each of these cards has six sides. Love it. Thank you. Thank you so much. And Deep Breath has got to be pretty good to hit. It gives two energy. Third Eye feels like it's probably good somehow. Indignation doesn't work. What are my actual outs that I'm drawing to? I don't even know if Ragnarok's enough. I don't have Nunchaku, so I go Calm, Eruption, I have 5 energy, Expunger, Ragnarok. Expunger is 90, Ragnarok is 72, 162. Okay, so Ragnarok's enough? By itself? Ragnarok's enough by itself. But is that only if I... It's only if I don't have to play a third eye. Whereas with Worship, I can play a third eye. I think what it comes down to is I'm unlikely to win. Um, and I have a variety of ways to have a non-zero but also not high chance of winning. If I discard Worship and hit Prostate, Prostate still discards so that Insight can draw more cards. So Prostate's still an okay draw. Potion's basically an energy potion. I am saying prostate, sorry. Let's try this way. For deep breath. Uh, is this enough with bronze scales, actually? I mean, 
it is or it isn't. Seventy two. Is that fourteen? So I need to survive five hits, so it's not enough. What a terrifyingly close run. I still want to believe that I did the math wrong. Did we tie? I think we tied. What if one of the relics wins for me? That was a tie, yeah? <laughs> Thanks for the 50 gifted subs. Holy shit. Nine eruption, 24 smite, 24 smite, 90 expunger, 30 windmill leaves it at eight. Do I get three bronze scale hits? 12 block. 24 block. I take 16 and 16 and 16. No, I die on that line. This is always how playing these watch runs feels. You always like have to think harder than usual and then you get to the end and then you die on the last turn by 2 HP and you're like, man, if I spent another 2 minutes thinking I would have won. But it's always another two minutes. Hide heart with a Ragnarok and Conjure Blade. We'll take it. 